All right, welcome back to our Lego Harry Potter Hogwarts Castle Lego set 71043 build video. This is video number two. In, number three, we did yes, our unboxing. Okay, number two, oh. build video number two. We did do an unboxing video, which was really, really fun. Uh, then we did a video... Um, with build we did half we did about half of the book this is instruction book one of four we did poly bags one two and three today our goal is to get through poly bags four five six and seven and finish off this instruction book right here now with bags one two and three we were able to build the stand with Grodrick Gryffindor on it the stand of the four founders yes these five boats and, and then this, this giant thing. Yes, this giant thing, which is we think is the base of everything, although we don't think the it's dungeon. complete yet because we know it's supposed to be about two feet long, and this is about a foot. Oh. Um, this right here, we believe, is a boathouse also, for it. Also, another way we kind of know it's incomplete is it has kind of bright colors sticking out every once in yes. a while. Yes, and we also have on the back side here these swing pieces that yeah. something will probably connect on. Um, there was a lot of connector blocks used and we did connect some things on it on both sides. This side w is fully done as far as those connector blocks, but this side still has lots of places for connector uh, blocks yeah. to go in. So I do believe that, you know, this is going to come out this way some. Um, trying to be really careful. Now, when we did end our last build video, we were missing a piece. Yes, and we found it in bag three. Yes, so poly bag three had fallen off of our table over here, and the the one by two connector piece was still inside the bag that had fallen off. We have since put it in right here, and we've added on that one by one with the little holder piece the on one top by of um, it. Our, the yes. one by one connect. Yes, so we are completely finished with all the steps for bags one through three. That took us through step 72. It took us like an hour, 10 minutes. About an hour and 10 minutes. Um, we do have all the micro figs still in the bag. I found Draco and Ron in there. Yes, and there are some other characters. I'm just not entirely sure who all of them are. Um, so we do still have that. We do still have our sticker sheets. Yes. Uh, we used five stickers last time. We still have something like 60 that have not been used. Um, I don't know how many are going to be used today, but we're going to try to get through bags four, five, six, and seven. Here is bag four. We've got a few bigger pieces. I see another few connector things. So we are going to get it open here. Oh, look at that. It's it is the snake. If you guys haven't seen the movie, this or read the book. Yeah. A giant snake. Let's make sure we get all the pieces out. When when Harry was trying to find the Chamber of Secrets for something I don't really remember. Dad, do you remember why he um why he was looking for the Chamber of Secrets? Yes. Yes. He was looking for the Chamber of Secrets. Um, because he was worried about the school getting shut down. And also at the end, Jenny Weasley got dragged into the chamber. And so he was trying to help his friend, Jenny, escape. So when he tried to go in, when he went in, he got in successfully without any um trouble. Well, but he didn't get far of saving at his friends and getting out. Also, did I mention that he also found a journal that belonged to Voldemort? Yes. Like this magic journal that belonged to this guy called like Thomas Tom. Tom Mavalo Riddle. Yes. And if... And he, Voldemort actually changed his name up and made it an anagram, so he his name would be um, 
that, so Harry I, and people wouldn't suspect yes. a thing. Um, Tom Malvolo Riddle became I Am Lord Voldemort. Yes, and this giant snake appeared, and that is when Harry discovered that he was pure Gryffindor. Well, not really. Like, during the snake fight, he did pull out the sword of Gryffindor. Yeah. But he didn't find out that only pure Gryffindors could um, pull it out until... Um, what's his name? Um, Dumbledore? Professor De yeah, Professor Dumbledore um, told him that only pure Gryffindors may wield the sword. Yes. All right. So we've got some bright green that I've just added. I've added these two tall blocks, and then behind it, I've added a square one by one, and then these two half circles, and then a two by three, um, and then a a black uh, one square plate here. Um, I'm not entirely sure what area I'm working on. I guess this is the, going to be the Chamber of Secrets because I'm kind of looking ahead and I see the snake coming out of it. So, I guess this area right here is the Chamber of Secrets, which we do know that that's part of what we are working on because uh, when we start Instruction Book 1, that's what it showed us. However, there is a connector for this guy, so we're going to hang on to him for just a second until we get there. I don't see anything that he can um, get placed on, though. Because well, I haven't put it on there yet. Now, this is an interesting piece. I don't think I've ever oh. seen a Lego piece like yeah, that. Yeah, it's like a... Oh, I thought it was like an L flat, but no, it's like a U flat. Yeah. Like a U shaped with no pegs. And there are two of them. One for each side. Also, special thing. Nope. And then these kind of triangular flats are going to go in there I'm inside the curve. Ooh, a triangle flat. I also never seen one like that before. We're seeing lots of new pieces. Yes. I guess with 6,020 pieces, you got to get creative. Okay, this is going to go right here to hold the snake. Oh. And then... Where does it hold it? Let's see here. I'm trying to see... Oh, man, I messed up. Where is our brick separator, Judah? The brick separator? I thought... Let's use... I don't know where um, I should have one next to the TV if you want to go look in there. Okay, so... I'm working on this right here, and this was supposed to go back even with this, and I put it too far forward, so i got to get it off so that I can fix that. Good catch by me. All right, these brick separators are great tools. Okay, where was the piece that I had in my hand when I realized I messed it up? There it is. I set it on the book and couldn't even see it in the book. Okay, this is gonna go right here like this. Then one on the other side. I am here, like Gryffindor. This. I'm, wait, cutscene. <laughs> Oh, no. Okay. okay, we're gonna put these on okay, top of the green here. That did not happen. Then we're gonna put some two by one flats next to those. Come on, Grodjet Gryffindor. You're pure okay. Gryffindor. I use four of those, I use two of those, I use one of those, one of those, two of those, and two of those. So I'm done with that step. Alright, we are ready for the snake. Hey, Dad, I wonder if Roderick Gryffindor um, slayed another giant snake before Harry did. I don't before think before. so. It would be cool if, like, Harry was, like, repeating Roderick Gryffindor's... Godric? Godric Gryffindor's encounterment. It would be. I don't think it happened that way, though. There we go. So now you can see... 
The snake is now secured into the chamber using that little hook piece that we put in there. He can also move around. I am looking for... Oh, sorry. Why, does, why do I always... I'm looking for pieces similar to this but different. Oh, I'm looking for a black piece. That's why I can't find it. I was looking for a gray one, and it's this black piece. Okay, that makes more sense. Helps sometimes to look at the directions on top. Instead of just looking for pieces. Okay. Then we're going to put some bright blue behind these. And then these are going to sit on these brown ones that we put on there in the last step. Okay. Okay. Now we're gonna put an arch for the snake in. Like a rainbow? Yep. Oh, it's like no, it's in the center. It's in the center. No, it's right here. And, and then, then two put, little pieces. No, we're on this one right here. So we're gonna put this long piece right here over the back of this. Okay. Now then, we're going to make, so we need three by ones, and a two by one, this is going to go here, and this is going to go here, and this is going to go here, and then another one of those black pieces that I couldn't find earlier, or two of them, are going to go on top of here. So, okay, so we're making pretty good progress here on our snake. He's got a cool little cave temple. entrance to come out of now. Yeah, yeah, like a little temple thingy of some sort. Why did the four founders f found a, on something that was a school that has so many secrets and dangers? That is a good, good question. Maybe they just haven't explored the land that much before. Or the... maybe magic is just dangerous no matter what you do. Yeah. You tried your best, Godric. You tried your best. Now, the Chamber of Secrets exists because Salazar Slytherin had a difference of opinion with the other three founders, and so he hid the Chamber of Secrets. Oh, so that's why there's a giant snake in it. Yeah. Because Salazar Slytherin is a Slytherin, and Slytherin is a snake. Yes, and Salazar Slytherin was what is known as a parcel tongue, which meant that he could talk to snakes. Also, um, Harry's a partial tongue, right? Yes, he is. So is Voldemort. Okay, so now we've got these. They almost look like Technic pieces or car pieces, but we are not going to use them as that. Instead, they're going to go into the chamber here. Hey, Dad, um, remember... I wonder if they have a Lego set of um ha of the zoo where Harry fell in that snake thing and talked to that snake. Yeah, that would be interesting. I've never seen one. That doesn't mean it doesn't exist. Uh, it could be definitely could be an older Harry Potter set, but I have never seen that. Yeah, like the zoo breakout. Mm -hmm. If you haven't seen the. In the movie, Harry never knew that he was magic because his his uncle aunt and aunt said that they died in a wreck. His parents died in a wreck, yes. But they actually died because of Lord Voldemort. Right. Whoa. Okay, we need 12 wedges for this next step. 12 wedges? Yep. But I don't want cheese. We are actually on a no cheese diet right now, so we don't even have any cheese. No dairy allowed. Nope. <laughs> but I have exceptions. Sometimes. No. Oh, and no, we are not lactose intolerant. Nope. We we're my dad just. 
wanted us to be on a paleo diet. And for that, we have no milk, which we know that we... You still have milk, but no... They drink milk, I don't. But yes, there's no dairy on paleo. However, I have lost 46 pounds, which is awesome. And our whole family is getting healthier. Uh, It's been a little bit harder to keep up during COVID. But we have been doing a great job. Lots of fruit and veggies. Everybody's buying all the food. (laughs) Yes, everyone is buying all the food. Okay. scared. So, here's what we have so far. Here's where all those wedge pieces went, alternating side to up. That looks super hard. Yes. However, let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And it said to use 12. So, that means I missed 2. And I see where they go now. Dad? Yes. Can I have a piece of cheese? No. Can I have some milk? If you want some. Okay. So those remaining two went here. Now we've got a really cool place for the snake to come out of. Oh, and it is sticker time. No! Stickers! Yes. As we discussed yesterday... Stickers are my least favorite thing about Lego. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, so 17, 19, and 21. Okay, I see 17. I guess these are just supposed to help you look like rocks. My question always is. And always will be. Why can't they just make printed pieces? They make printed pieces, so why can't all the pieces that they want things on be printed? Okay, 19. Yeah, like, like why couldn't they do it like with the face? Like, the face is already printed on. Yeah. Like. Well, and, oh man, I did a whole job of that. I feel bad for you. Okay, and then 21. So I'm guessing these other three stickers that look just like it are going to go on a similar side once we get to it. Okay. We're out of milk. So there are our stickers. Oh no, what are we going to do? I know. Okay. You can't like that attach to? Milk. Right here? Aha. Uh-huh. Oh. You, you broke it. Yep. Okay. You, you, there we go. That went on to that brown thing that we put on earlier. I'm going to guess that I'm going to turn the page and it's going to have me do the other side. And look, there it is. Boom. Why couldn't they just put it on the same side? <laughs> or put it in the same steps? I don't know. That's a good, good question. Okay. Where are these? I mean, like, when oh, I said there. same size, I meant the same size of the paper. Okay. There's that one. Okay. So now 18, 20, and 22 go on these. Do we need to sanitize this? No. Okay. I I just wanted to use hand sanitizer. Okay. On my phone. COVID! Pick it up. Beep, beep. Man, the straight one is hard. It doesn't go. You see him f- fidgeting with these stickers. You can probably guess why I don't like them very much. There we go. Come on, nice Hi. and clean. There we go. What did I miss? Uh, me messing up a sticker. It's they're almost impossible yes. to get out. Okay, so now then, and it kind of almost looks like a face. And this is a nose, and these are eyes. And I, I remember see. there being like the snake coming out of the mouth in the movie. So maybe that's what they're trying to do: seeing the nose, oh, and the eyes, and the like mouth. Oh, like an so, ancient temple. Yeah, nose, eyes, mouth with the snake coming out. So I did not see that till just now, but it definitely looks like a face. 
Also, I, when I was trying to get to the exact page that we opened up to the first, when we stopped last time, um, I may have looked ahead by accident. Uh-oh. But there's a really cool piece that I figured out that there is. Oh, interesting. It, it's a gong, like a weird gong thingy. Huh. Mossy, rocky, mossy, rocky. Yeah. Oh, wait, the green part's like the the eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm going to put this right here. Keep it from moving around. I want to eat you. You look so juicy. What are you talking ah, about? I want to eat you. You are being very... Interesting right now. Okay, got all those. All right, it looks like we are moving on to a connector part here. I'm not sure what this is. Look at this picture. Do you know what that might be? Oh, the gong thingy. The gong thingy. Okay, so that's what we are. Looks like we're building a room with a gong. I don't remember there being a gong in Hogwarts anywhere. Yeah, but it's like a weird, like, shield gong looking hmm. thing. I guess we'll see when we get there. Can I build this? Uh, I'm gonna build this. How about you build the, the next bag? Okay. All right. This is what I got so far. Interesting, interesting. One of these on. Now I have built with the Lego, I forget what it's called. That's pretty bad, because I built with it a lot. Um, but the robot system that schools use a lot, um, and they have a lot of pieces like this that go into those robot systems. And, I've built dogs and guitars and oh. all sorts of crazy things. Oh yeah, did I mention that I have like this giant Lego robot set that you can like change into different things? Yes, it's like really it's like cool. massive, like up to my knees. It's huge, huge. I say. I turn this over. It's the go. Only Salazar Slytherin is all Slytherins are allowed down here. Hey, Dad. Yes. What do you think? Um, type of house Hagrid was when he was a kid. I think he was a Gryffindor. I think the story implies that pretty hard, but I don't actually know. So comment down below what you think. Hagrid yes. was when he was a kid because because in this set it actually mentioned um the Thomas guy Tom of all riddle aka Lord Voldemort tried to trick Harry into thinking that Hagrid was the one who opened the Chamber of Secrets yes grits all those years ago yes because it took harry through voldemort's memory and showed that hagrid was opening the chamber of secrets but was it really the chamber of secrets no it was him trying to get his to his spider family in the forbidden forest yes okay this is coming together very interestingly Hmm. The gong thingy. Gong, gong, gong thingy. Now I think we're only going to get 
partway through this gong build in this bag, and then it will continue on in the next bag. Yeah, because I don't see any gong piece of some sort. Yep. Unless if there's a sticker that goes on this. Maybe. Could be. there. Uh, oh, I bet it's the door. The door? Yeah, to the Chamber of Secrets. I didn't know that was a front door. Yes. Knock, knock. Harry had to use parcel tongue to open it. Oh, so only Slytherins could get in there. So only the heir of... Wait, what? Only the heir of S Salazar Slytherin could get in, yes. Wait, so does it? Does that mean that Lord Voldemort is related to Harry and Harry is related to Salazar Slytherin? Well, it definitely means Lord Voldemort is related to Salazar Slytherin. But what about Harry? He's parcel tongue. Yes, that is a good, good question you had. Now, remember, uh, you can say whatever you want in the comments, but Judah has not finished the books, so he does not know the whole story yet. So Did that's I why mean? he's guessing right now. He also hates surprises and not being told things. So he wants me to give him spoilers all the time. Do yes. I give them to you? No. Nope. I don't like it. I like, like, I like the surprise part, but I just don't like the secret of the surprise. Yes. Like, it just annoys me. Like, trying to guess what it is is just getting on my nerves. <laughs> just gets on my nerves like that. Like a blink. I'm not very good at snapping, even though I'm 10 years old. <laughs> okay. This. I also backwards. don't know how to whistle. Whistle. My dad said whistle. I, I, don't I meant know. whistle. Okay, so I built this thing backwards somehow. So I'm going to fix that real quick. This is supposed to stick out this way. I think Slytherin is a rattlesnake. Because... If you take, if you saw the tail of the giant snake. No, it's snake, a basilisk. It is? Uh-huh. You looked it up? Well, that's the story, buddy. It's a basilisk. Oh. The snake of Slytherin? Mm-hmm. I wonder if there are any, like, special mythical creatures that represent other things because there's a giant snake. Oh, the snake of a Slytherin on the thing? That I don't know. I'm sorry. I'm talking about the actual snake in the chamber is a basilisk. I thought there was it, there was only a basilisk lizard and it could walk on water. Well, Bump remember back. this is uh, this is made up stories. True. With magical creatures like giant snakes. Yes. And dragons. Yes. And And griffins. Yes. And head and headwigs. Wait, is that a mythological creature? A headwing? Hmm. A owl? Owl. Oh. It's a snowy owl in a warm climate, so I guess that is sort of weird. Yeah. I don't understand. Oh, I'm supposed to do two of them. Okay, okay. Y'all messed. Uh, I did. Because not only was I not paying attention to what I was doing, but I put one in upside down, and I didn't realize it was asking me to do two different ones. It's a frisbee! Sing! Ah. Only a parsh here. And then I'm going to do another one. So I guess that means that um, Harry is pure Gryffindor and pure Slytherin, I, I guess, a little I bit. Don't, the hat did try to put him in both houses. But Harry was more um, Gryffindor. That's why he was able to pull the sword out. But then again, he was able to open the door with, par with partial tongue. Parcel tongue, yes. Parcel. Okay, so we do need that piece that you're playing with. The the black disc? The, yes. the frisbee? Oh, he's here. Here. He's one of our kitties. Yes. He's Here's the other him. cat. So yesterday, Boomer. And at the beginning of today, Boomer. And then this is Sooner. He's so cute. He's 
Okay. So it wants me to put the disc on first, then put on the sticker. However, I'm going to put the sticker on first. Sorry, I just love Sooner so much. She's so cute. Yes. Okay. And that's going to go on here. And that is going to go on here. I want to. For a door. Whoa, and it moves. Yes, it does. I would expect it to be more like a vault, like you can actually open the door. Yes. Let's see how this works once we get it all together. Who knows? Maybe it's even actually magic. Maybe. Okay. Oh, Sooner's eating her food over here? Okay, let's leave Sooner alone, okay? Sorry, she's so cute. She's just mad, I think. Oh, and I put it on backwards. Wah, wah. Wait, is there even a backwards? Yes, there is. Because this is supposed to be facing this way. Okay. So that will probably make a difference. Remove the button. Gryffindor plus Slytherin equals Harry Potter. Now we were talking about our Patronuses today. I, I'm a white mare. A white mare, yes. Do you know mine? No. Uh, reindeer? Nope. Mine is actually quite ironic. Hmm? That clue? Yep. Um, an ironic owl? Nope. Not an owl. I give up. It is a basset hound. Now, why would that be ironic, Judah? Because they try to scare away bad people? No. Because I am afraid of dogs. What? Oh, yeah. My dad had, like, a dog when he was a kid, and he got bit, and... It wasn't my dog, but yes, I did have a dog when I was a kid. Okay, I messed something up horribly. Oh, uh, the snake... The snake going in here because he should be free and, and in the wild. Free, be free, snake! I'm free. Okay. 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 This was supposed to go here. This was supposed to go here. I'm backtracking because I have messed this up. I stopped putting pieces on. I got so focused on this door thing. Reverse the motto! Oh, come on, you gotta be joking. This doesn't work. At least Lumo squirts. I think. Lumos? It works pretty well. Infinity! We shall build this in 90 days. Imagine if it took us like actually 90 days to build this. That would be crazy. Oh, I just realized something about the design of the door. What's that? If you um flip it um up, it looks like a bunch of snakes sticking out. Yes. <gasps> oh, Sooner's right there. Yes, the Can door you? is designed Can to look like snakes. I mean, on it. obviously. That was a sticker piece. That did not happen. I did not remove the snake. Okay, let's leave it alone. 
I have to say this is actually a pretty smart thing. Yes. Oh my no ma, only partial tongues can enter the chamber of secrets. Okay, looks like we're that building is. some kind of door opening system. Boathouse called a boathouse when boats boats don't have houses. Well, these boats do. Oh, I guess because they're magical, they have a mind of their own. No, a uh, boathouse is just a place that you store boats. Whoa, that looks so cool! Yeah. we're gonna show it to the camera here. Try and get these pieces in, which I am struggling with. I don't have boulders that much. It's literally spring. I don't like spring. Like, I like spring, especially because the Easter Bunny comes, but I don't like spring because... Because of allergies? Yes. yes. I, allergies plague our family quite well. Oh, no. Especially me. My nose... My big hands and putting this piece in is not going well. Let me try with my small hands. Yeah, okay. So, it needs to go into that hole. Oh. Huh. Okay. okay, that's easy. You should have just asked me in the first place. Well, I got all the others. You mean the two, the one other? The three, there's three others that I already put on. Hmm. You got it pushed in. Oh, it has yeah. to go in the hole. Yeah. Wait. Okay, let's not break it. Man. Okay. There we go. Okay, so here's what we've got. Here's our door inside of here. Here is I want to go top. in. We've got these swing pieces on here. Okay. Now the door doesn't move. Oh, well, it comes off. But it doesn't move back and forth anymore. Wait. So I'm interested to see what exactly we're going to do with yeah, this. Yeah, if it's not... Wait, can I see it? Okay. There I want to look. On... Partial tongue. Oh, it doesn't move at okay. all. How do you get through? I don't know. Maybe another step in the build will actually like cause like something to like reel it up. Yep. Like there's like a string or something. The plague. The corona. The COVID-19. Here. Okay, now then. I want milk. Okay, these swing pieces here. I'm going to line up. Oh, that's what they're there for. Yep. I don't know why we didn't build that straight away. Nope. They don't move, they're just there to make this angle. Oh. Okay, and the swing pieces that were on it are That's now locked sad. into place. That is sad. I, I'm very okay. disappointed. So there's the chamber entrance over here. The door is on this end. We've now attached it onto our base here. Okay. Let's see here. Nothing. Okay, stop please. Stop please. Okay. Let's see here. Looking at it like this. It wants me to add this piece, and I do not see where it wants me to put it. Okay, let's see here. Judah, look, I'm here. Do you see where it wants me to put this? I'm not seeing a spot. Oh, right here. Uh, like, like, right here? Yep. Like that? Yep. Push it down. Okay. Goodness gracious. Okay. That's hard. <laughs> then, we're going to put this circle piece here. Like the door? Here. I don't want a door. Hey, Dad. 
Yes. But just to remind you, we are using micro figs, so maybe yes. one of the micro figs can fit through that little gap. <laughs> maybe. In the bottom. Although I don't think that that's what they intended. Yeah, I think that they intended like a device that wheels it up. Okay. Like I missed wheels. a piece in here. This little orange piece is supposed to go in there. Okay. I. There we go. Okay. All right. So, right now we are saying these are extra pieces from bag four. Do we have our extra piece bag? I think it's over there if you want to go grab it. Yay! Time lapse. No, no, don't time lapse. Yes, time lapse. All right, we are moving on to bag five, and we are going to encounter our first pieces from in here. The zero bag. Yes. So, it says that we need... Three, I think, of these. Um, four. Oh, four of those. Okay. And three of the more cliff-like. Yes. So, you get bank five open. Yay! Legos! What's that? I found tiny snakes. I found a tiny snake. Yes, those are going to go over here, it looks like. This time we have less chunkier pieces and yes. also some more brighter pieces. Okay. So now then I'm looking for those cliff kind of pieces. Not the mountain kind of pieces. The cliff pieces. Mm -hmm. See. They go everywhere. Yes, let's free. not make a big mess. Okay. It has to be these. Okay. Okay. I think mom also just made her first appearance in our thing when Maybe. she yelled in the background. <laughs> Maybe nobody heard it. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, so the first step is going to involve those pieces there, buddy. Those These snakes. These the decorative snakes. Mini, the metal snake. Yep, so we're going to turn this back around because we're going to start working on the chamber again. So They don't fit. Stop. Make sure you're following the directions. Okay. Oh, why didn't they just say so? Well, they did. <laughs> oh, uh -uh. I'm not that very good at the. Well, he's doing that. I'm gonna place these for him. snakes it harder than it look so before he goes on I'm gonna while he's working on those I'm gonna show you everything that we've done so bag five we added all of this and this over here now I did just add these two pieces from bag five so but all of this is bag one two three and four now remember there are 37 total bags plus these three extra bags so 40 total bags uh, we're touching our first extra pieces from those extra bags in bag five's instructions but this is bags one two three and four this is what we have We've got some great detail here on the entrance of the I chamber and the, the chamber itself snakes. and now he is Adding in some snakes into the chamber. Metal snakes. Stone. Oh. I okay. Thought they would be so go ahead and put them in, so we can move on to the Wait, next step. Wait, is it um one gap from one gap? Yes. Like that? No, they go in front. Oh. Mm. Like mm -hmm. this. So do the ones on the other side. There you go. I'm building bag five. Okay. All right. Oh, now then. It's your, like snakes are hailing to their yes. snake over. Okay. Them. For your next one, you need four of these. Yes. Four of these and four of these. Okay. What those slides do? What? Snake pyramids. 
So the the one by ones are gonna go on top of each other. One by one on wide? Yes. I mean tall. Okay, and those are gonna go in the middle on each side. Um, no, 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 on top. There you you should be more specific. <laughs> well, I pointed to the exact spot. Okay, and then those other four pieces you have are going to go on either side. Like this? Let me see. Yes. All hail the snake overlord. Yes. It is a snake temple inside of there, isn't it? Yeah. Indiana Jones would not like it very much. Wait. Who's that? I never <laughs> knew Indiana Jones before he died. <laughs> All right. Okay, we got those in, so we are ready for the next step. Okay, so now we need big arches. And three more of the one by ones. Nope. So this is going to go across here. Whoa! And then those are going to go here, here, and here, but not here. What? Yep. That's a weird thing to do. Yeah, I think so too. It must mean that something else is going to go <gasps> there. Maybe it's the little thingy that opens the temple door. I mean, it's super far. No, remember, it's not a temple, it's a chamber. The Chamber of Secrets. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. And he and Jones would probably call it a temple. Maybe. Okay, all right. So now that we need a one by two, a one by three thick, and a one by two of a different color. Right so the brown is going to go on top of the gray. Like this? Mm hmm. And that's going to go here. Like right here? Yep. Like that? I can't see with your hand, but yes. Yep. Boom! Okay, and then this is going to go across here. So weird. Okay. Wait, I spot a num another face! Okay. Oh. Okay. No, Mountain stop. pieces. Sorry. Okay, so a wedge here. Like a brown a, wedge? A, no, a great wedge here. Like light yes. gray? Yep. Right. Here. Okay, a dark green here. Dark that? green. Dark green. Dark green. I thought that was pretty dark green. Like that? Yep. Okay. And then another light gray wedge here. Like that? Yep. Okay, then one of these guys right here, sticking out that way towards that green wedge. Nope, yep, yep, there you go. Okay, all right. Now then, there's going to be a tall slope. Nope, forward, here, okay. And then another tall slope right here. Or rocks. Okay. Okay. Then a one by one thick right here. I got it. Okay. All right. Then you need two smaller slope wedges. One right here and one right here. Like these? Yes. So one's gonna go right here. And the other's gonna go right here. Like that. Yep. Okay. All right. Now then, we need another one of these to go this way. Wow, it looks like an actual mountain with one piece of moss on it. Okay. Now a thick L. Never right seen here. a thick L before. Yep. Stop pushing so hard, buddy. Sorry. They go on. You don't have to force it. Okay. Then a another light gray wedge right here. 
Nice pulls. Nope. Facing this way. Like pulls? Yes. Boom. Okay. It's wonky. Okay. All right. One, two, three. It says that we're supposed to use four of those wedges. And I only see three. Where did we miss one? Oh, one's supposed to go right here. Like that? Like this. Okay. Push. Okay. All right. We use three of these. We use two of these. We use one of those. We use one of those. We use one of those. Okay. So that's what we got. And now we are going to put it like, right here. That's why I was suspecting. Yep. It's not cool. There we go. Okay. It looks like an actual like rock yep. snake temple thingy. Looks pretty cool. Like right. the tiki face. The tiki face. Okay, the next thing is we're going to put on some more deals. No. So we need a green slope. Nope, not a wedge, a slope. <gasps> Good and it's enough. going to go right here. Yep, put it on. Sorry. Bloody. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, you gotta put it where I point to, or else it won't work. Okay. I wonder what's gonna hook up to there. Don't or know. if it's just detail. Might just be detail. Might be a rod of some sort. It's hard to know. Okay. It is the young one. What did I say that young one? I'm the youngest. We got sun pieces. Yeah, okay. One more wedge. And it's gonna go right here. Okay. Alrighty. Now we're gonna do another cliff piece here. I don't want to. <laughs> I can do it real quick. Okay. Alright. Sun pieces. Four. Whatever. Now that's an interesting piece. Where do you think a bright yellow piece is going to go? There's a couple bright yellow pieces over there, aren't there? Oh, me too. And uh, another turquoise and a uh, light blue. And a light blue. Look at all the bright colors that are in here, guys. Yes. Like, there are okay. so many bright colors. Yeah. It's so beautiful. So pretty, 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 pretty. I'm collaging. I'm collaging. Making a Lego collage, art collage. Okay. All right, I used two of those. I used one of those. I used three of those, I used one of those, I used one of those. Alright, I think that one's ready. I'm going to guess it's going to go not where I thought. Okay. It's going to go right there. No, right here. That was not what I was expecting. I was expecting it over here. Okay. Alright. Bright red. Oh, so we're using one of the bright colors. Yep. We're gonna use more than one. Okay. I need There's... Judah, I need this piece right here. Oh, you mean, you mean the sword looking piece? No. Oh. Just a long piece. That one right there. Sing! Right. I'm collaging. Nobody disturb my collage. It doesn't look the same without Retta. Retta, 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 Retta. 
Alright, I need an aqua that aqua piece you got. Turquoise? Sure. It's the turquoise. Waffles. Teen Titans. Go! Do, 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 do. G -E -E -N. It's a beautiful staircase collage. Okay, so we built our own kind of little rocky thing. And it's going to nestle right here in between these two. There we go. And that mm. connects all that together. That looks like a mountain with missing yeah. a, an entire I think top it's part. the side of the mountain for the castle. What? Yeah. I never saw that. And I was the one who made me a box. This, this right here. Okay. okay. Dark green. Right here. We're going to put a. Hey, Dad. What yes. do you have to say in parcel tongue to open the door? To the Chamber of Secrets, I, I think sort you have of to forgot. say it open. Oh, I thought there would have been like secret code, like cells are Slytherin. I think all you had to say was open. Oh, that's disappointing. <laughs> right, adding a lot more the moss and rock look to it. Okay. You'll My, need where are we? the bright yellow. Okay. I need to move this. Hey, I thought I was building this step. Now that you stopped. <laughs> I'll keep building it then. Okay. Build, 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 build. Okay, turn it around. See, we done. Okay. It's going to go right here. That goes, Judah, right here. That go right here? No, right here. Um, okay. I go right there. And then one of these is going to go right here. Okay. It already looks like home. And then we're going to add two more L's. The mic. Yep. How long okay. have we been recording for? Quite a while. Uh, about an hour now. What? Yep. Okay. Hang on, this may take some more time than we thought. Maybe yep. even two hours. More than a full movie. Because <laughs> most movies only come out. We knew it took so long to build a Hogwarts castle. Yeah, we've barely even done anything, huh? Yeah. And who knows, maybe it will take three hours to get through all the bags. Might. I think we may stop when we finish bag five. I think we will today. We had a pretty ambitious goal of getting through four bags, but it has taken us a little bit longer with these two, so I think we will stop after bag five and come back and finish this book and bag six and seven next time. I think that that is a good, good plan. They keep turning this on me and putting stuff in different places. I think this is going to go right here. Or Castle Mountain. Nope. Okay, this wedge. Oh, no, it didn't go on. There we go. And this wedge did not go on. Now there we to go. put the top of the castle. I think it's going to be a little taller than that. Like that? <laughs> uh, maybe a little bit taller. Okay. Like that? Back up. All right. Okay. It's going to go right 
there. Maybe. Does not want to go in there. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Let's see here. Where are the other pieces that it's adding? Okay. Me no no. Hey Dad. Yes. If we broke your phone, would we be breaking the fourth wall? <laughs> I hope not. Let's not try it and see. <laughs> Somewhere. Oh, right. Here. Well, Dad's doing that. Check out uh, the channel Game On. It's my channel where I play a bunch of video games. Yes. Right now I'm in the middle of completing Skylanders Imaginators. So go check that out. Yep. My original channel name was. Judah's Journey, so I guess YouTube didn't really call for that, so type in Judah's Journeys to go to Game On, and... I think you can type on either. Oh, no, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. So, make sure to try to like and subscribe. Yep. It's awesome. We're going to be playing a ton of games. Who knows? Maybe we'll even, even do some toy reviews every once in a while like we're doing now. Okay, that's going to go right in by those L's. Okay, we are definitely getting the base of the castle built up a little bit more. Very interestingly, it's having me add a lot of one by one bricks on these, and I'm not really sure what the purpose of that is. This is a lot of rock and detailing right now. So, this is really cool. It is really hard to see where they're adding some of these pieces. I'm back. All right. Also, guys, by the way, the reason why I'm so worked up, like, all the time is because I have autism and ADHD. Yes. It kind of makes it hard to do stuff. Especially when you don't take your medication. Yes, I have a medication that helps with my ADHD. However, Friday, today is a Friday as we're recording this, and Fridays around here are usually a little bit more relaxed, right? Yes. And, uh... Yay! We just didn't take our medication because it was a little bit more of a relaxed day. Also, wait, no, I just forgot. Well, at least, Ross, don't put that on there. It would be perfect, it though. It might be, but that's not where it goes. Another one of these. Stop, please. I'm not putting it right there. I'm putting it in a different spot. He doesn't know what he's doing. I wonder in the very last instruction book, maybe it will show um all the all the um stuff where the minifigures go because uh, in our first video it never showed us where the these micro minifigures go. Right yes, Dad? It has not showed us a spot for those. I found Ron and um, Draco in there. Yes. Oh, I think I just found Voldemort. Interesting. Okay, that's 
going to go on right there. We built a pretty solid back wall of this thing. Here, when we're done, Ooh, we're going to turn it around. Oh, we're going to turn it around so everyone can see it. I'm going to do it this way. Lots and lots of detailing. Hey, Dad, is. Dad? Yes. Is Dumbledore a partial tongue? That is a good question that I am not going to answer you right now. Maybe somebody in the comments will leave you an answer for that. Comment down, also, comment down below what things, what um house do you think Dumbledore was when he was a kid? Yes, I think he was a Gryffindor. Same here. But that is a good, good question. Comment down below if you think you know the answer. And we'll try to look the the answers to the questions that we ask you to comment down below to who um in the next video i don't know if we're going to answer comments this episode I don't think we will this time. Maybe next time if we have a couple, we'll answer them. Yeah, maybe like the first thing next episode. I don't know. Yeah. After, after the intro. The intro is like the key to every YouTube video. Like you start <laughs> it and end it with like an intro and ending thing. Like, hey guys, what's up? Or like... What's going on, guys? It was not guys? even, so like it wasn't like quite that. down. Okay. I like video okay. Baseballs. We are running out of pieces here. We got two more of these that I think we're going to do. I made dragon scales. Okay. All right, where's your L piece that you want to play oh. with? Fortnite, take the L. Now, this is the first time we've touched the uh, boathouse island since we put it together in bag one, pretty much. Ooh, spooky. Not really. I want a cookie. Okay. I need dragon scales. You need the peace you'll walk Is it? Um, yeah. Green piece. I don't have a green piece. Mm? I already did that. Mm. It's right here. I'm over here now. You're just behind. How dare you? My behind looks beautiful. Not a behind, my behind. You're full of dad jokes today. I thought I was the dad. I want to eat a cookie. I don't think I we know. have any cookies. We do. Oh. We have Girl Scout cookies. No, I gave those to your Aunt Bethany. Mm, no, they're still here. Okay. Okay. Just waiting for me to eat them all. Let me add them. Okay, we are gonna finish this up here in just a second. That looks actually not that bad. So in this bag, we mainly focused on the walls of the Hogwarts castle. Yes. And not that much of what was inside or like the floor of the dungeon. Right, Dad? Right. And the top goes right here. Wedge pieces get hard to put on. There we go. Okay, got all those. Who's that? Oh, hey, it's mom. I want a cookie. (laughs) 
Yes, we are. We are almost done, though. We are getting close. Hey, Dad. Yes. Why is Harry called Harry? I don't know. Why? Because he has hairy armpits. Oh, my. Take it. I don't know why they thought that name. Yeah, I don't know why J.K. Rowling picked the name Harry. Rowling. I'm pretty sure it's Rowling. Okay. No, I'm not sure. Who knows? I shall power that? that out late. It didn't. It didn't work. Last one of these. Hey Dumbledore, how's it going? Good for being a small figure. You did not hear that. <laughs> they use a lot of wedges on here. Right here. So how long have we been recording? I don't know. We will look at the end. reviews we're going to be doing after we finish the castle. I don't know. I ha like, don't have any plans right now. Like maybe we could do like Dragomons or like Gujitsu. Maybe. Okay, this reviews. wedge right there. Or maybe we could do okay. like a gaming thing. Yep. Okay. So we are down to just a few pieces and it says that we are done with bag five. So, we're going to put those pieces off to the side just in case we mess something up. And we and will see. Here, we're going to take a quick look at everything that we did. So, we've added all of this onto our base and built in the Chamber of Secrets. So, all these walls, all this detailing, that was what we were doing. All these little rock and moss wow. details all the way around to here. So, it starts here next to the Chamber of Secrets. I wonder and went if it's all the way around to here behind our boathouse. We also built the Chamber of Secrets with the face and the entrance over here. Um, and so that was what we did with bags four and five. We have been recording for about an hour and 15 minutes now. So two bags, about an hour and 15 minutes. And that is our results for today. Next time we will definitely finish this book of instructions with bags oh, six and seven. And we will see you... Wait. Don't forget to like and subscribe and yes. hit that notification because bell. Because you'll want to know when we upload our next build video. So please like this video. Please subscribe to the channel. And we will see you guys next time. Happy building.